what is the main topic for this video here today? Knock it out list. I want to talk to you about the knock it out list. And I want you to type it in there, knock it out. All right? Most people have this, this terminology that they use. And the terminology is a to-do list. Now, anytime I tried to have a to-do list, there's always something to do on that list. It just, it never felt the way it was supposed to feel uh, for me as far as getting stuff done. So years and years ago, it's been a long time ago now, and, and I do this a lot with a, a bunch of stuff. Please go ahead and put a 777 in the comments. Let me know you are hanging out with me. But years ago, I decided to change the wording. And I just did another uh, video just a little bit ago here uh, in a different group, and I was sharing about wording, and it matters. It matters that we don't just accept the words that are given to us in the business that we're in. For example, instead of to-do list, I call, what I do is I call it a knock it out list. Things that I have to knock out, I have to get them done. Because if it's a to-do list, it's it just doesn't give it the oomph, the, the real power that it actually needs for you to be able to move forward and get it done, right? So if you actually change the wording from to-do list to knock it out list, Think of that. Think of the, the shift that happens in your brain when you start thinking like that. I want everybody that's on here right now, and if you're watching this video a little bit later, put in their knock it out list. Change the way you word things. Look at all the things that are around you in your business. All right, there's so much going on, and you have a lot that, that's happening, and we're being fed terminologies that we've just accepted as reality, as this is how it's supposed to be. And this to-do list concept has been around and has just been around for so long, we've all just accepted those words as reality for who we are. But gosh darn it, it doesn't match me. It may match you and be totally fine. Don't switch anything. Okay, if it 100% works for you and you're cranking and you're rocking and everything is amazing because you have these this to-do list that you just rock on, hey, all is good, but for for individuals like me that have tried over and over and over to do a to-do list and it just did not resonate with you, is that how you say the word? It, it did not inspire you. I think that's how you say the word, resonate, Res, resonate, yeah, resonate, yeah, that's the word. Uh, if it did not resonate with you, <laughs> all right, we're gonna, we're gonna have a, 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 a linguistic class today. Hey, guys, what are you doing? I'm talking to my friends here. <laughs> so we'll close the door real quick. So seriously, this is this is day one of uh, me sharing with you terminology. Okay, shifting shifting the way you look at what we're told on a consistent basis. Okay, we have to stop stop being the norm, stop being exactly like everybody else and doing it the same way everybody else is doing. If we continue to do that, all we're gonna be is lumped into the heap of pile of everybody doing the same stuff. We, those of you that, that are gonna be working with me as we continue to move forward, we're gonna, we're gonna come at it from over here. We're gonna come at it from over here. We're gonna turn our back on what they're saying and look at it from a different set of eyeballs and come at it from over here. We have to switch it, we, we do. If we don't, we're just part of the, the, the overall encompassing of what everybody else is doing, and then we're just another thing in the marketplace, right? But if we can stand out, and the only way we can stand out in the marketplace is, first and foremost, by being you. Secondly, by changing the terminology that everybody's telling us is the terminology we're supposed to be using, and change it. Completely just shift it so we can shift our thinking. And when we shift our thinking, all of a sudden, other things that are supposed to be going on in your life start to surface even quicker. And it's just as simple as taking your to-do list and scratching that out and calling it knock it out list. So thank you all for joining me on this video today. I appreciate each and every one of you. Happy weekend. Talk to you guys soon. Take care, everyone.